so you can go on pinterest as i've done and you choose whatever pattern you want to choose i chose ipinifa because i wanted to do ipinifa and i modified it and yeah here's the drawing of the top part of ipinifa and then here i just wanted to show you how to make your edges very neat and clean uh, so you take your bias tape which i bought i sometimes make the bias tape but this time get tangile you put it around the edges so the, the bias tape has grooves on it so those grooves you have to line them up with your fabric and then that's where you're gonna sew so with the right sides of the bias tape and the right side of the fabric you put them together and then you sew into the grooves i'll just show you how to do it exactly how i've done it right up into the edge of the armhole and then here we are you see can you see those grooves you have to go right in on them and line them up with the fabric and you just go right around the whole armhole until the end as I'm doing here yep you just have to be careful and then once you've done the whole armhole you go back and you do what's called a an edge stitch I think I'm not even sure of the word the right word but it's an edge stitch so what this stitch does it it, it keeps the bias tape on the inside so whichever side you're folding it onto it will keep it on the inside so yeah just right on the edge just exactly as how I'm doing you just sew right on the edge of the bias and yeah just make sure that the fabric is facing on the side of the bias the whole fabric that's underneath is facing on the side of the bias tape now that's done you can just iron it down and this is how it looks once you've ironed the whole bias tape being down yep you see that edge stitch this is what it does it makes it lay down flat once you've done with the edge stitch you go in now and you stitch on the inner edge of the bias just to make it a bit more neater and then you, you can go on and stitch your sides together right sides facing and you stitch and then it's gonna look something like this once you've done the stitching on the side i'm sure it's a bit clearer now yep and that's your bias tape should look something like that and that's how i finish it off and now for the bottom part of lily pinifa i just took um an old pattern that i have of uh, uh, a round dress that i made for for one of my kids yeah and you just place it on the fabric fold the fabric into half Usigensh as you see um goba i was doing for ingani so the length is a bit short so i just added on the length and i'm cutting now right around the whole pattern yeah you you can also get uh all these patterns from marlene mokai i'm not sure if i'm pronouncing her name correctly but yeah that's where i get most of uh, my pattern i just discovered her and she's excellent if you are willing to draw good dragon you have to be willing to draw the patterns because she just has them um like how i showed you in the beginning on pinterest so it's just a drawing on there and then you just have to draw out your size and make it to your uh, fit and you can also alter it in whatever way and however way you want to alter it I wanted like a rounded finish to Ipini Falami. I didn't want the, the straight cut. So yeah, that's what I did to change up the bottom of, of Ipetaniak Marlene. 
and yeah this is the rounded parts and then i'm just gonna cut off uh one side of the pattern you skate eh? just gonna cut it off so that it has that effect happening if i when i put it around my waist and then you take le party le young is auntie you put it together with the top part so right sides facing together you just line it up the skirt parts with the top yep just like so i have to search for the middle parting first so that's what i did you look for the middle part section the middle part and then you just sew right through you see once you put them together line them up right sides facing and then all the way through to the other end and yep you take it to the sewing machine and this is how your penny file will look on the inside and voila, I just added ties and here goes your pinifa. Thank you for watching.